So now I'm going to climb up on this machine and we're going to take a look at this major layout difference and, and some of the benefits that is going to happen to the technician and to the operator on their daily basis. And uh, it, it is a large machine. We encourage three points of contact and you'll walk up here and we have several different doors here. Um, you can see that you can open up this compartment and this is where the batteries are at. This is uh, cold weather system on this machine, 24 volt. Our battery compartment is in there nice and clean. Over here is your windshield washer fluid. Uh, that, that's where the compartment is for it. But one nice feature that you have in here is, depending on the time of year and where you live in the world, um, you might have days when you start early and it's dark, or you're done and it's dark. And something we've done is, we've found a way to illuminate the entire back system of this. And there's a light switch right here behind the window. And I flip that on so you can sheer see the difference of the light that's giving for the safety for the operator and the technician to get on there and do their work. So if you would, I think we'll invite the camera to come up here and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll show you some benefits up here. Okay, so we're up on, to, on the deck of the 395 now and we're directly behind the cab. And as you can see, there's a large platform there to stand to do your, um, your swing drive checks. It's nice, clean, simple system, easy to work, easy for maintenance and easy for your daily inspections. There's, there's a lot of uh, foot traffic area up here that you're not having to climb over hoses or uh, work in those tight conditions where it's not easy to work on hoses of that size. You need some good working room and I think we've done a great job of, of doing that. So now we're going to take a step back here uh, where we've got this nice large platform for the operator to do some daily checks. We've got our hydraulic uh, sight, fill, sight gauge right here for the hydraulic tank which is directly behind this panel. And you walk in here and you're going to directly see filters, easy exposed filters for easy maintenance. And if we can make this easier on anybody, this is great. Typically on an F-Series 390F machine, you would have to access this side from the other side of the machine, meaning that operator's got to climb down, they got to get up on that other side, come up and do their checks, climb down, come back, get in the cab, and then they go to work. This time, they can get up on one side, stay up on one side, and get directly to work. So being able to limit the, the times that you have to get up and down on a machine this size when it's wet, snowy, muddy, uh, I think we're gonna eliminate a lot of uh, potential accidents. So we're pretty excited about that. And, and the folks that have seen this machine already and the service technicians that have looked at it are, are thrilled by this new layout. So we'll climb up here. It's nice and clean. And it, everything you need to do for most of your filters, most of your uh, maintenance is all right here with You've got your three canister filters right here. You've got your hydraulic filters right on the other side. Pull those cartridges out, swap out your filters. Uh, everything is nice and exposed, easy for you to get at, easy for you to work, limiting uh, the foot traffic up and down on the machine. Right here, this is still has a C18, 542 horsepower. Um, the old traditional C18 that we have, but there's so much room in here. And what, what this highlights is what you can see with that light as down below there's your engine oil dipstick. Great open bay here to see what needs to be serviced to check for potential leaks, check for bird nests that sit in there, whatever happens to these machines. You know, again, these don't sit out in, in all the pretty elements of the world. We wanna make sure that uh, we do a good daily inspection and check all of those service points. And something else we have is right behind me, we've made this standard on a lot of the next generation excavators is our filtration system, our air filtration system. These are standard with all of our next generation excavators, but what these are standard with is a pre-cleaner. And what I mean by that is I can take these off and you see all these little holes on the front. That's part of the pre-cleaner system. And these are these little turbine type systems in here and they're sucking in that dirty air and they're dropping it down and it's not getting sucked into the filter. And then you've got a large canister type filter. And what we're saying with this, and if you're getting 500 hours out of your existing filter, we're gonna get a thousand out of these. We're doubling the life of, uh, lifetime of the filters for these machines. And uh, we're hearing that from the field that they're, they're working. And the pre-cleaner system has uh, been a big change for us and we're pretty happy to be able to have that as a standard feature.